bevo.com. Tim, you, you talk about in your book about sort of uh, raising equity and the right way of doing that. And one of the tips you talk about is never go too late to try and raise money with your trousers around your ankles, I think you talk about. But you've raised a lot of money at Waterstones and lots of rounds of money at Waterstones. So do you have any advice for entrepreneurs as the best way to get equity and get funds but without giving away too much of the shop? Well, the value of your company when you're growing it has got absolutely nothing to do with its balance sheet value whatsoever. I mean, that's just, you know, it's got nothing to do with that. The value of the company is, is the value of the company in the eyes of the person who's coming into it. And they're going to buy it on self-confidence, on the quality of the brand, and the self-confidence of the entrepreneur. You just talk the price up every time. And never ever allow any, any share issue to go at a lower price than the last one. Always just talk the price up and up and up and up. And then everybody gets in. The other thing which I think is a very important trick is if you're going to raise money from a number of different sources is to make sure everybody's in the tent, not outside the tent. So you make them become directors. So they want to become directors, you make them come to board meetings. So they hear all the time what's going on. And so they get, they get, it gets, the thing gets into their soul, it gets part of them. Mm -hmm. it, it's make them come in and share with you both the triumphs and also the disasters. And when there's bad news, push it out instantaneously. So make everybody part of the same story. There's nothing worse than to be caught with some bad news which you haven't given up, you should have given up. Yeah. Would you always suggest that entrepreneurs go through the sort of the friends, family and fools first and then goes on to the angel, then goes on to the, to the venture capital? Is that a sort of normal route that you would recommend? Yes, to a certain level. I mean, I think you... But I, I don't think you should keep on clawing back into your own family the whole time. I think you've got to be slightly careful with your friends as well because, you know, you can lose an awful lot of friendships and... and there are plenty of plenty of angels out there at the moment. There are plenty of angels. There's plenty of money out there. I mean, at the moment, the debt situation is so important, it's so impossible. That it really, really is difficult. But that'll ease in the coming months, sometime or other. Uh, but equity is available, and there are an awful lot of sources of it these days in professional investors. There really are. Bevo.com. <laughs>